Inca Mythology Unveiled The Top 10 Most Enigmatic and Powerful Beings 1. Viracocha, Creator God Viracocha is the supreme deity in Inca mythology, revered as the creator of all things. His narrative transcends the physical realm, signifying the mystery of the universe's origin. Viracocha is often depicted as an old man with vast powers, embodying wisdom and authority. He is credited with creating the sun, moon, stars, and all living beings. In some myths, Viracocha first made giants, but later destroyed them in a flood and created humans. He is also associated with order and civilization, having taught humans arts, sciences, and agriculture. Viracocha's myth signifies his disappearance across the ocean, with a promise to return. His cult was less about worship through temples and more focused on his omnipresence and role as a distant, all-powerful creator. 2. Inti, Sun God, Inti, the Sun God, is one of the most revered deities in the Inca pantheon. As the progenitor of the Inca emperors, Inti's influence is deeply woven into the empire's political and social fabric. He is symbolized by the sun disk and is often depicted with a human face on a golden disk emitting rays of light. Inti's importance extends beyond religious reverence, he is also the god of agriculture, essential for the growth and sustenance of crops. The Inca ruler, considered a direct descendant of Inti, held immense power and responsibility, embodying the god's authority on earth. Major temples dedicated to Inti, such as the Coricancha in Cusco, played significant roles in rituals and ceremonies, especially during solstices and equinoxes. 3. Mama Kia, Moon Goddess Mama Kia, the Moon Goddess, is a central figure in Inca mythology, symbolizing femininity, beauty, and time. As the sister and wife of Inti, she holds a complementary but crucial role in the balance of Inca cosmology. Mama Kia is also the protector of women and the regulator of menstrual cycles, tying her to the concept of fertility and childbirth. She is often represented in art as a beautiful silver disc, mirroring her brother Inti's golden one. Lunar eclipses were particularly significant events, as they were believed to be instances of Mama Kia being attacked by an animal. Rituals and sacrifices were conducted to protect her during these times. Temples dedicated to Mama Kia also served as sanctuaries for women who had been harmed or widowed. 4. Pachamama, Earth Goddess. Pachamama is the revered Earth Goddess, embodying the mountains, land, and all its bounties. As a fertility goddess, she is central to agricultural rituals and is revered for her ability to sustain life. Pachamama is not just a benevolent mother figure, she is also known for her wrath, believed to cause earthquakes when displeased. The reverence for Pachamama is deeply embedded in daily life, with offerings and ceremonies conducted regularly to seek her blessings and maintain a harmonious relationship with nature. The concept of reciprocity, or, Aini, is fundamental in worshipping Pachamama, emphasizing the importance of giving back to the earth what one takes from it. She is still venerated in various forms across the Andean regions, reflecting the enduring legacy of Inca spiritual beliefs. 5. Iapa, God of Thunder and Rain Iapa, the god of thunder and rain, wields immense power in Inca mythology. He is often depicted holding a club and stones, symbolizing thunder and lightning, respectively. Iapa's role is crucial for agriculture, as he controls the rain and weather patterns, directly impacting crop growth and water sources. He is sometimes represented as a serpent, which is a common symbol for water and renewal in Andean cultures. Iapa was also associated with warfare, as the Incas believed he used his thunderbolts to strike down their enemies. Offerings to Iapa, especially during periods of drought or excessive rain, were common, seeking his favor for balanced weather. Iapa's temples and shrines often featured high in the mountains, closer to the skies where he was believed to reside. 6. Supe, God of Death and the Underworld, in Inca mythology, Supe is the feared and respected god of death and ruler of the Yuku Pacha, the Inca underworld. He embodies the darker aspects of the cosmos, overseeing the realm of spirits and ancestors. Supe is often depicted as a daunting figure, commanding a legion of demons known as Supekuna, which could also mean spirits or lesser gods of the underworld. Despite his fearsome reputation, Supe's role is vital in the balance of the Inca world, maintaining order in the afterlife. His domain is not only a place of the dead but also a source of mineral wealth, connecting him with miners who would perform rituals to appease him. During the Inca Empire, the fear of Supe was significant, 
with ceremonies conducted to protect the living from his influence and to ensure a peaceful journey for the souls of the deceased. 7. Khan, God of Rain and Wind Khan is an ancient pre-Inca deity associated with rain and wind, integral to the agricultural cycle and environmental balance. In some Inca myths, Khan is depicted as a creator god who fashioned the first humans from clay. However, he is primarily known for his role in bringing life giving rains and winds to the Andes, essential for crops and sustaining life. Khan's character is often portrayed as benevolent but unpredictable, mirroring the capricious nature of weather. In times of drought or extreme weather, the Incas would invoke Khan for his intervention to restore harmony and provide necessary rainfall for their fields. His worship was deeply connected with the agricultural calendar, highlighting the dependence of the Incas on the natural elements for their survival and prosperity. 8. Mama Kocha, Sea and Fish Goddess Mama Kocha, the sea and fish goddess, represents the vastness and bounty of the ocean. She is a symbol of life, fertility, and the nurturing aspects of water. As the mother of all waters, Mama Kocha is also associated with rivers, lakes, and rain, making her an important deity for fishermen and communities living near water bodies. In Inca mythology, Mama Kocha is often regarded as the wife of Viracocha, the creator god, and is sometimes depicted as a mermaid-like figure. Rituals and offerings to Mama Kocha were common, seeking her protection for sailors and fishermen, and her blessings for abundant fish and calm seas. Her influence extends beyond the physical realm, symbolizing purification, renewal, and the flow of life. 9. Urkchile, Deity of Animals Urkchile is a lesser-known but significant deity in the Inca pantheon, serving as the protector of animals, especially llamas and alpacas, which were vital to the Inca economy and society. Often depicted in the form of a llama, Archile was believed to reside in the Milky Way, which the Incas saw as a celestial river where the souls of animals dwelt. Herders and pastoral communities would offer sacrifices and perform rituals in honor of Archile, seeking his blessings for the fertility of their herds and protection from predators and diseases. The deity's role highlights the Incas' deep respect and connection with nature, emphasizing the importance of animals in their cosmology and daily life. 10. Apu Mountain spirits. Apu refers to the spirits of the mountains in Inca mythology, revered as powerful protectors and providers. Each mountain peak was believed to be the home of an Apu, and these spirits were considered as living entities with their own personalities and powers. The Apis were venerated for their control over weather, their influence on agriculture, and their ability to provide fresh water through melting snow. They were also seen as guardians of local communities, with each region paying homage to its local Apu through rituals and offerings. The worship of Apis was deeply personal, mountaineers and travelers would make offerings before embarking on journeys, seeking their protection and guidance. The concept of Apu reflects the Inca's profound reverence for nature and their understanding of the interconnectedness of the environment, spirituality, and survival. Inca mythology, central to the cultural and religious life of the Inca civilization in South America, is a rich tapestry of gods, rituals, and cosmology. Predominantly polytheistic, it revered Inti, the sun god, and Viracocha, the creator deity, as principal figures. These gods were believed to directly influence daily life and the empire's fortunes. Mythical narratives often revolved around natural elements like the sun, moon, and stars, reflecting the Inca's deep connection with nature. The Inca rulers, considered divine, were thought to be descendants of the sun god, legitimizing their authority. Rituals and sacrifices, including offerings of food, animals, and sometimes humans, were vital practices to appease these deities. Inca mythology also encompassed a rich afterlife belief, where one's deeds determined their fate in the next world. The myths, transmitted orally through generations, played a crucial role in maintaining social order and cultural identity. For more videos like these please like, share and subscribe and please press the bell icon.